She love how I'm rocking it Betty's all up on my rocket ship And she call me Zaddy and she got a fatty And she's so provocative I'm touring and rocking shit Yeah, she love how I'm confident Yeah, I'm dope with the shows and my shoes and my clothes And my glow is just hard to miss Welcome or welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you don't know who I am, I am Simply Holly and I'm so thankful that you clicked on this video. Today's video is, of course, what the title says, trying out some popular influencers' workouts. I did Mad Fit, MK Fit and Pamela Reef. Okay, let's get on with the video. I'm going to pick one of the MK Fit workouts. I'm thinking between the Greatest Showman one or the Mamma Mia one because they both sound like a great choice. For me, she's got High School Musical, Mamiya, Greatest Showman, 2000s Pops, uh, Disney After Dark, yeah. Set my Apple Watch off to see how many calories I burn, how my heart rate stays at. Obviously, the Apple Watch is not the most accurate of statistic readers, um, if you could call it that. It's probably better if I use like a heart rate monitor or something, but I can't find my heart rate monitor at the moment. body's just working fully and you do it quick spurt as you can see I'm rather sweaty so total time was 26 minutes I'll put the thing on the screen here total time was 26 minutes active calories burnt 230 total cal calories burnt 276 and the average heart rate throughout the whole workout was 166 bpm I'm moderately fit I but honestly, I do think that was a fun workout and I do suggest, recommend that you do it. Hi guys, okay, it is the next day um, from yesterday's workout. Um, today's workout is going to be a mad fit workout and at the moment I'm just letting my breakfast go down. I had granola with coconut milk in it and just ate that up, enjoyed it. Um, now I'm just letting that go down and then I'm gonna go do a workout because I don't have a lesson until like the very end of the day. Um, I'm ready for the gym. I have a gym shark set on, the purple energy seamless set, I'm pretty sure it is. And I'm gonna throw this crop top also from Gym Shark on. <coughs> <laughs> Why does it feel like that? Um yeah, I've never done a mad fit workout before. I've seen her around a lot and she's been recommended to me on YouTube like so many times but 
I just never got around to, to doing it. We're already doing a workout. Oh my god, are we? I hurt my legs. Jesus. Okay, we'll get the 20 minute booty going. Yeah, at home, that's totally okay. Just use what you have available to you just so you can increase the intensity a little bit. I have five. So, the way that this works is so we're here for 45 seconds. So, down and up. Really feel that resistance on the band. Press those knees outward. Coming all the way down, press those knees out and up. Down. For you. Make sure you're really sending those hips back. Press through those heels and squeeze in. Hang up the top. So this time I'm doing this ab one. Um, it really hurts. It really hurts. She's doing a move right now, but I need a break. <laughs> What I've gathered from doing those workouts is that MadFit focuses a lot on form and like strengthening and doing things slowly so that you can be doing it correctly and then you work in the correct muscle. found that her music is a lot more like neutral, like vibey music instead of like hit pop, like um, you know gym music that like give you like really motivation like really have fast beat tempo music uh, that are really loud and you actually feel like they're just, just shouting at you she kind of just nicely gives you it i'm gonna do a pamela reef workout obviously i could do one of her booty like uh, leg workouts which i think most of influencers are well known for but i'm actually gonna do upper body today because i've trained lower body hit and I've done some abs. I'll probably maybe do one of Pamela Reef's ab workouts if I can find one that I want to do. Maybe like a 10 minute one, which I can see right now from two months ago that she posted. Um, With weights, I'm going to use two five kilogram dumbbells. regular like non-copyright YouTube music. We had a bit of why don't we in um, the ab workout. The ab workout hurt a lot more for me because I'm still got the doms from yesterday's ab workout with a uh, mad fit but this one was just as brilliant and I will honestly be switching between the two. But for that two workouts that I did that only took 30 minutes I burnt 120 calories and my heart rate was at an average of 136 bpm. Wonderful food, yummy, glorious food. Natural woman, what should I do? My feet are dying! <laughs> I've always given you my best behavior. You gave me everything I asked But I've grown up in this one thing a stranger I'm sick of- 
Shut up, pilot. Shut up, pilot. What is it called? Air Force Air. Ah, forget it. Stay fit. Check it out. Sugar, what's she doing? Can you feet up quick, but fast? Get out of my way. Yeah. <laughs> this is how chaotic my brain is. Okay, so today I did 120 calories of functional strength training, which was the arm workout and the ab workout. And my average heart rate was 136 BPM, and my obviously total calories was 178, but I only ever look at the active calories burn. So that's 120, and the time it took me was 28 minutes 58 seconds, and then for the dance one, which was like that 10 minute one with the Kylie Minogue air hostess line, um, move, sorry. I burnt six, 69 active calories and total calories was 87. And my average heart rate was 153 BPM, which obviously isn't the highest, but that just, I could tell with that workout that it wasn't absolutely killing me. Okay, so that is the end of today's video. I'm not sure how long it is, but I did all three workouts and I enjoyed them like so much my favorite was to do was mk fit just for the fun of it like mk fit was one of the funniest ones to do 100,000 percent she has the greatest showman mamma mia high school musical workouts hamilton workouts they're all phenomenal i will definitely be continuing doing her workouts i also felt like it burned a lot and it was having fun for like 20 minutes and burning like a load of calories the next one that I really enjoyed, Pamela Reef. I wasn't expecting to enjoy Pamela Reef as much because I've seen her channel and she's so beyond shredded. Like her abs are amazing and she always filmed in like the most gorgeous locations ever. But I really enjoyed Pamela Reef's upper body workout and the last movement where my abs were just in a circle was honestly, I didn't think it was gonna hurt as much as it did and it really like, it aches. It's her dance workout that I did, the Love Songs one, it was more funny for me because I couldn't be coordinated than it was to burn any calories or like um, shred. I do Pamela Reef for um, she's great with farm and everything else. And then Mad Fit. Mad Fit is probably one of the most well known as besides from like Pamela Reef or Chloe Ting. Mad Fit. I have never done one of her workouts before in my life until this video. I enjoyed it so much. I like that she focused mainly on form. She wasn't exactly shouting at you like some instructors do. You know, like each video, they're like, come on, come on, guys, you can do it. Only one more rep. She wasn't doing that because it's not her style. I did very much enjoy her booty workout though, and it really burnt. Like, my booty was like fire, on fire after that workout. So. I definitely suggest it and my abs as well haven't changed abs in ages and i loved that video but otherwise i really enjoyed my fit really enjoyed pamela reef and i really enjoyed mk fit so i'm doing pk fit if you're going for something that's fun quick hit related will make you sweat like a pig how you doing Sweating like a pig, actually, in yourself. All the workouts were good. All the workouts did me a good job. And I honestly think that if you were to work out consistently using the videos on these people's channels, you would probably get somewhere. Obviously, abs are made in the kitchen. Gonna, gonna make sure you have a good diet. But yeah. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure you get a big thumbs up and hit that like button. That's the same thing. And I hope you enjoyed. Make sure to subscribe. And I will see you all in my next video, which... We'll be on Thursday next week. Bye-bye. You call yourself a free spirit, a wild thing. And you're terrified somebody's going to stick you in a cage. Maybe you're already in that cage. You've built it yourself.